Okay, tonight we're going to go over fact and opinion. Uh, you guys should be very familiar with fact and opinion, but we're going to do a couple of exercises tonight to help uh, refresh your memory on how to figure out what is fact and what is opinion. First thing is, the fact is a statement that can be proven to be true. You might want to write that down in your notebook. A fact is a statement that can be proven to be true. So here are some examples. Turtles have hard shells. Okay? That is uh, proven to be true. If you've ever touched a turtle, you can tell that they have hard shells. The scientific name for cats is Felis catus. Okay, that is the scientific name for cats is Felis catus. That is a fact. There are seven days in a week. If you look at a calendar, there are, in fact, seven days in a week. And in England, soccer is called football. That is also a fact. Okay, here are some ways to verify whether it is a fact or not. You could um, interview a scientist. If any of you know a scientist, uh, maybe you can have them come in and talk to the class because I don't know any scientists. Uh, you can look in an informational text or a nonfiction book. You can read a documentary, which is generally based on fact. You can look in an encyclopedia. And you can make observations. Okay, scientific method, good. All right, so an opinionated statement, so an opinion is based on how someone thinks or feels, okay? If you hear the words, I think, or I like, or it is the best, those are opinion sentences. So you might want to write that down. An opinion statement is based on how someone thinks or feels. Billy Bob tells the best jokes I've ever heard, okay, the best. How do we know it's the best? Maybe Miss Friendly doesn't think it's the best joke she's ever heard, so... It is not a fact, it's an opinion. There is no other ice cream as good as this. As good as this, okay? Good is a feeling word or a thinking word, okay? I don't like ice cream, so maybe the ice cream is not as good as anything else, okay? Reading and writing are my favorite subjects. This would be a key word right here, too, my. Are my favorite subjects in school. That is an opinion. Okay, because your favorite subjects are not necessarily my favorite subjects. Though reading and writing are Miss Fernley's favorite subjects. Okay, don't worry about what's going across the top because you're not in class. But you are going to do some facts and opinions in your notebook. Okay, this is Binky's facts and opinions. So you can write these down in your notebook if you'd like. Well, Miss Friendly plays along. So we're going to decide if Francine and Buster are saying facts or opinions. If I say Pal has four legs, that's a fact. It's a fact because I can show somebody else why it's true. No matter who says it, it's true. Pal has four legs. But if I say Pal is the best pet, that's an opinion. It's an opinion because I can't show somebody else that it's true. Somebody else might think that Nemo is the best pet. We would have different opinions. In this game, you'll hear Francine and Buster say some things. Then I'll ask you, is what they said a fact or an opinion? Click the fact button or the opinion button to make your choice. To hear anything again, click any character. When you get five right, we'll watch a fun video clip. She is standing. Is it a fact or an opinion that she is standing? Okay, is she standing a fact or an opinion? Hey, great job! It's a fact that she is standing. She is a girl. Is it a fact or an opinion that she is a girl? You got it! It's a fact that she is a girl. He is wearing pants. Is it a fact or an opinion that he is wearing pants? Good going! It's a fact that he is wearing pants. His shirt is weird. 
Is it a fact or an opinion that his shirt is weird? Hey, great job! It's an opinion that his shirt is weird. I don't think those pants look good on him at all. Is it a fact or an opinion that his pants don't look good on him at all? That's right! It's an opinion that his pants don't look good on him at all. You got five right! Click the arrow to watch a video clip. While you watch, see if you can spot the facts and opinions. Hello, Arthur. I see you overslept your alarm clock. What makes you say that? You're wearing two different colored socks. Your shirt's on inside out. And you didn't brush your teeth. It all points to one conclusion. You were in a rush. Why? Because you slept late. That's amazing. I'm reading Mrs. Marble's handbook for young detectives. It's all in the detail. That's the end of that video clip, and that's a fact. Now back to the game. Click the green arrow to play some more. Uh, if you guys want to play on that on your own time, you can go to pbskids.org, and you can find all kinds of games that will help you practice your skills. All right, here's some more practice. Okay, is it a fact that rivers flow? Let's see. Rivers flow into the ocean. Rivers flow into the ocean. Okay. Fact. All right. How about our school's name is Eagle Eagle Nest Elementary? Would that be a fact or an opinion? Fact. Uh, dogs or cats are better pets than fish or birds. Dogs or cats are better fish or better pets than fish or birds. Fact or opinion? Okay, 9 plus 7 plus 4 equals 20. Is that an opinion or is that a fact? Um, that would be a fact because it's math, but I'm, um, yeah, and it's correct. I had to do my math a second. All right. I have no idea what kind of pizza our cafeteria cooks, but it's nasty. I have no idea what kind of pizza our cafeteria cooks, but it's nasty. Is that opinion or a fact? Uh, pears are too sweet. Pears are too sweet. Fact or opinion? Bananas are a type of fruit. Bananas are a type of fruit. Fact or opinion? And finally, reading is much more enjoyable than playing video games. Miss Burnley thinks so. Reading is much more enjoyable than playing video games. Okay. Opinion. Let's check. Um, no, I'm right. I don't know why this is not right. Okay, well, we are right. Rivers flow is a fact. Our school's name is a fact. Math is a fact. Dogs or cats are better pets is an opinion. I have no idea what the pizza is, but it's nasty is an opinion. Pears are sweet is an opinion. Bananas are a type of fruit is a fact. And reading is more enjoyable is an opinion. So those are right. Ignore the PowerPoint. Okay, so in your notebooks, you're going to answer these questions. Question one, which of the following is an opinion about insects? Which of the following is an opinion about insects? Number two, which of the following is a fact about magnets?
Number three, the Great Wall of China was built over 2,000 years ago. Obviously, you don't have a B and D. It's either a fact or opinion. Okay, identify the opinion below. Which one of these is the opinion? A, B, C, or D? Select the statement which does not identify a fact about magnets. So you're probably going to be looking for an opinion. If it's not a fact, then it must be an opinion. A, B, C, or D. Okay. An urban area is a community inhabited with lots of people. Is that a fact or an opinion? So it would be B or D. Look for clue words. So even if you don't know what an urban area is, you can look at clue words in a sentence to see if it's a fact or opinion. All right, examples of a suburban community located near a city, shopping malls and neighbors are within walking distance. So some examples of a suburban community are located near a city, shopping malls and neighbors are within walking distance. Okay, fact or opinion. Again, look at clue words. Does it say I think, I feel? That would be an opinion. Does it seem like it's based on fact? That would be a fact. Okay, everyone should study geography. Everyone should study geography. Fact or opinion? Boy, oh boy, it sure takes a long time to get to a neighbor's home in a rural community. Okay, look for clue words. What is a long time? Fact or opinion? All right, so for your WSQ, write one fact sentence and one opinion sentence. Tell me how you know the difference. And tomorrow we'll go over the answers to those questions.